Hey there everybody and good morning. I just wanted to do a follow-up from yesterday's video because I realized that, you know, maybe people would like to see a little bit more of the process and get more of an idea of um, what things are going to look like. So I wanted to show you first the um, nutrient that I'm using. Um, it's a really good nutrient. We've been using Fox Farm for years um, in our other growing operations. So this is a, a really trusted company. I think that uh, I'm pretty sure that their stuff is um, really, uh, I think it says non-GMO on here somewhere. And it's, it's just a good company. I know you can use other nutrients in your hydroponics systems, but um, we've always liked Fox Farm, and their products have treated us well, so we stick with them. And then um, I want to show you, because in, in your little pots that, that I'm going to show you tomorrow, um, you're going to need to put something around the uh, cube because there's going to be space and you don't want the light to get in there to the roots. So what we're going to use is perlite. We could use the uh, clay uh, beads, I guess they're called, uh, media, but they're a lot more expensive than the perlite and I just feel like perlite is better for this application. So that's what we're going to use. And, and you'll see how that's going to work when I get ready to pot these. And then, and then, to put our pots in our hydroponic solution, we're going to use just regular household items. I've got a yogurt container here with a lid and a glass mason jar. And I'm going to show you how we're going to put all those together tomorrow. <clears throat> But first of all, and not last but not least, <laughs> uh, let me show you the root system on this cucumber. It's already coming out of the bottom. That's a really good sign, really good sign. Because um, when you get ready to plant these, you're going to need to make sure that the roots are touching the um, nutrient solution in the container. You'll, you'll see what that looks like when I get ready to do it. So these are all looking really well. That's the Space Master cucumber. And then we have more seedlings that moved over today out of their little incubation area. So it's coming along nicely. And we'll have more on how this is actually going to look tomorrow. So thanks a lot for watching, and please go ahead and like and subscribe if you want to, if you feel so motivated. You have a great day, okay? Bye-bye.